run the circuit, you put 30 seconds on the clock. You have your five players, one through five. Coach Mack lays it in. The four man has to get out of bounds. He outlets it to the one. The two always runs the right side. The three all, always runs the left. Again, I know that some programs will interchange them. I see both sides of the argument. There's not a right way or wrong way. But our two always runs the right in Carolina, always runs the left in, in, in Carolina if you're the three. Four man takes it out. Our five man is the rim runner. So in run the circuit, point guard gets it. He throws it advanced pass, what I call up the street, which is the right side of the floor. The two man's going to take it. Boom, he's going to lay it in. Ball does not touch the floor. So the point guard may take a dribble. He's going to advance it up the street, layup. Meanwhile, that same team's running. The four man's getting the two man's layup, getting out, out of bounds behind the baseline, outletting it on the right side of the floor to our point guard. Now the point guard's going to take a dribble, and he's going to throw it across the street, advanced layup, to the three man. So now your two man, full speed, has made a right handed layup. Your three man, full speed, has made a left handed layup. Your four man now has to take it out for a third time. He outlets it to the point guard. Point guard might take a dribble and he's going to throw what we call an over the top pass to the rim runner. I don't want the ball hitting the floor. So your five man's running down the middle of the floor, catches that old Chris Collinsworth Cincinnati Bengals style pass, lays it in. Four man sprints, gets the ball again, outlets to the one. This time our point guard goes coast to coast with the ball. He's pushing, pushing, pushing. Just like in the games, nobody stops the ball. He goes all the way to the basket and lays it in. That was our fourth trip. Our foreman, who's exhausted by now, gets the ball, outlets it to the one, pushes the ball up, two's running right side, three's running left, five man's running rim to rim. Point guard comes down, sort of in the diamond look, looks at the five, reverses it to our four. Our four can either shoot a three, he can eye the rim, take one dribble, dunk the ball, that should happen for us in 30 seconds. That's called running the circuit. A lot of times we'll start practice with that. And we'll go team one, team two, team three, and team four. What I mean by that is I don't just turn to our players and say, okay, whoever hasn't been in, jump in. No, no, no. Team one, D Davis is the one. Team one, uh, Miles Davis is the two. This guy's the three, this guy's the four, this guy's the five. Maybe on team two, D Davis is the two. And you have a different point guard. So you already have it scripted. Takes three minutes. Boom, you're done. That's how we run our primary Carolina actions.